Welcome to Alex Loves Alex. We are back. Yeah, baby. Yeah, ang tagal no ma one year na ata tayong hindi nakapag-vlog. I know that it's been a really long time. Hindi kami nag-break. Okay. Oh yeah, contrary to popular belief, I know that like when YouTubers stop like vlogging, vlogging for like a long time, mm -hmm. the speculation is always, oh my god, maybe they broke up, maybe there's this, maybe uh, there's third that. party, ganyan. Nakapag-decide kami dalawa na wag muna kami mag-vlog kasi nag-focus kami lately sa relationship na dalawa. Sa mga hindi nakakaalam, sobrang tagal na namin niya. Like, yeah, in literal. We've been together for 10 years. Oh, babe, pag iniisip ko, like, 10 years? So, imagine yun niyo yun. Pag sinasabi kong 10 years, minsan hindi ako makapaniwala. So, dami pa naman nagsabi sa akin na mag-break kami. Pati family ko actually sinabi na mag-break kami. Love face lang yun. So, oh. Which is like a horrible thing to say. Why would you put that negativity out in the world? If you can see that people are happy, why would you even say that? Uh, I don't know. Yeah, I hate negative people. From the start, taman hindi naman kami next start sa social media. Next start kami from before, like a regular relationship. Like, minsan naka pressure na. Oh, gawin yun to. Gawin yun. Parang feeling ko ang daming nakabantay. Right, and that we're just doing it for social media, which is not the case at all. Ginawa namin tong YouTube na to para ano may meron kaming memory ng dalawa na mm -hmm. pagka matanda na kami na naalala mo yung ginawa natin to yeah, yeah, yeah. ginawa natin yung ganyan like an album like a photo album but instead of photo album it's all vlogs hindi lang namin inexpect na marami kami may inspire na lesbian na kamukha namin so our last video was like um, how we came out, right? Yes, and I know yes, you guys yes, were yes, like yes. waiting for a part two. We've seen your comments. We do read your comments and we know that you guys have been waiting for a part two from that. We're not really ready, I think, to... Um, medyo nakaka... Ano kasi ng memory. Alam mo yun? Kasi medyo sensitive yung part na yun sa amin. Thousands of tears later. I think for somebody watching, like for me as well, to watch somebody else's coming out story and to yeah. know that Oh wow, that's kind of like how it happened for me. If we can be of any help to you or any comfort that you're not alone, we will probably continue the part two. Yeah, so ang hirap din na, syempre social media to. Ayaw namin na iisipin niya, sinisiraan namin yung family namin. Syempre family mo yun eh. Yeah, and while we do love them, it was hard for us. Yes. You know, those are just things that we're trying to explain. It's not that we love them any less. It just, this is our perspective on what happened. We went to Vietnam. Yes, we went to the anniversary of the 10th anniversary in Vietnam. That is. We finally made it. It's about 8:30. Boarding is at 8:40. We will have touchdown in Vietnam at 12:10. All right, we will see you touchdown Vietnam. If you are in the military and not taking advantage of free access to lounges with the credit cards, you are missing out. This is the automatic beer dispenser at one of the Incheon Airport lounges. It fills from the bottom. Amazing! They also have free buffet and self-service open bar, which we love taking advantage of. After we landed, we stopped at a temple to sightsee before checking into our hotel. It was really gloomy and rainy and pretty much reflected my mood because I had realized I had lost my phone. It was honestly hard to enjoy myself because I was feeling pretty shitty about the whole thing. So even though I'm not religious, I prayed to this giant stack of Buddhas and it worked! Nam myo ho renge kyo. After finding out my phone was safe and sound, we headed to our next destination, the famous train street in Hanoi. You have to be invited by someone that lives there, and you can buy coffee from them while you wait for the train. Coconut coffee? Look at our tour, guys. You're so cute. <laughs> Tao! Thank you, Tao, Hannah, and of course, Miss Fan from Go Vietnam Travel. This is not sponsored, by the way. But we wanted to thank them. We ordered a coconut coffee and egg coffee. But we were two hours too early for the train, so instead of wasting time there, we took our picks and decided to go somewhere else. Yeah, I want to try it. One of the reasons we love to travel is learning about cultures through their local cuisines. We stopped to buy a coconut pandan sticky rice, and I gotta be honest, it was not my fave. We also checked out this picturesque church, St. Joseph Cathedral. And I'm happy to report we were not struck by lightning. We're still alive and gay. Picture! 8.01 p.m. That night, our tour guide Tao took us to the restaurant she works at part-time. Ang sipag ng bata. They served enough to feed a small village. And like true Filipinas, we ate it all. Sarap! 
There was Vietnamese pancake, pho, bun cha, fish, and spring rolls. <laughs> the next day. Five minutes later. Buffet lunch. Our cruise included lunch, dinner, and breakfast buffet. Can't forget the rice, condiments, and of course, Vietnamese appetizers. Uh, eventually. After our delicious meal, they took us to see the Halong Bay Pearl Farm, where we got to see how they farm different oysters and even kayak to go see them. But well, we're ready. We're ready. We won't sink. <laughs> I won't even attempt to pronounce the name of these caves, but they were so beautiful. You have to hike to see them, but it's worth it. Day two. We went to bed really early last night. <laughs> and we had already had some alcohol in us, and then we were rudely awakened by Mr. Jeepies. <laughs> First time long namin ulit makakita ng Jeepies. Kasi walang Jeepies sa Korea eh. Wala. We were sleeping. Tapos, all of a sudden, siya mi- Tapos sabi ko, parang, parang may something na kumikiliti sa akin. Sabi ko, oh, f***ing me. I'm so tired, ganyan. Sabi ko, ah, okay, let's see it. Kasi na-realize ko na, oh my god, that's not me. Tapos pagkakita ko, siya ko, f***ing. Ang laki talaga siguro mga ganyan. Gumagapang sa fez. Nung nasa mukha ko na, doon ko na na-realize na hindi si Bito. Oh my god. My eyes popped open so fast. One eternity later. We also checked out T-Top Island Lookout. It's 400 steps to the top and makes you appreciate the dragon-like shapes you can see from up there. Mind the traffic. Six and a half hours later. And of course, more eating. <laughs> later that same evening. Day three. After two amazing days on our Halong Bay cruise, we headed north to Sapa to check out Fansipan Peak. You take this cute little red train up to the first building, which has a buffet, and then a gondola takes you to the peak. However, it was extremely foggy and windy, so we couldn't actually see much. Visibility was only about 60 feet or 20 meters in front of us or less. Foggy and windy. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> it's broken. <laughs> it's broken. Later that same evening. When we got back from Fansipan, we strolled around Sapa for a while before heading to get hot pot soup for a really cold night. This is salmon and sturgeon hot pot. And it was so good. Whenever we visit new places, I also like to try the local beer. 
Here's a few that I picked up at a convenience store nearby. Day four. The last day was for souvenirs and of course, more eating. I actually pulled out the camera because I thought the thumbnail was coming out for a little bit. But it's not. I got a little bit of duck and dumpling. Buffalo. I didn't get the frog. I think I'll get the frog on the second go around because I don't want frog to be the first thing in my I like to eat, eat. Three thousand whoop who's later. And after a long day of sightseeing, eating, and shopping, we did what the locals do. Grabbed a little banquito and drank beer and ate sunflower seeds on the canto. I guess that's it for now. And you all just mm. what? <laughs> Tune in? I don't know. What do you call that? Yeah, Ayan, sige, susunod na lang ulit. Bye! Ingat lagi! Bye, guys!